Hello YouTube and welcome to your second Visual Basic tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to be covering how to install the Visual Basic 2010 Express IDE. Now let's head on over to Google and we'll just search Visual Basic 2010. And you can see the first link that comes up is microsoft.com slash express slash downloads. We're going to go ahead and click that. Now here's the downloads page. We're going to come over here to Visual Basic 2010 Express just click on that and select the language that you're going to be using. I'm going to be using English. So go ahead and click Save. And now open it up. It'll ask you to allow it to make changes. Just click Yes. It'll extract the files. It'll take a little bit to set up the installation components and when you're installing this you may need to install the .NET Framework 4.0 and uh, if that is the case it'll take a little bit longer than it'll take me so uh, let's just wait for this to finish it'll take a second here Okay, here's our setup window. Let's get this out of the way. Okay, we're gonna. You can choose whatever you want to do with this. Yes, send information about my setup setup experience to Microsoft. I'll just leave that checked as yes. Gonna click next. Uh, yeah, nobody ever reads these anyway. Uh, click next, and it says that all we need to install is Visual Basic. Now uh, you may need to install the .NET Framework, as I said, and uh, total download size is 54 megabytes. So let's go ahead and install this. Now uh, I'm going to go ahead and pause the video here and I'll come back once it's done. And um, okay. Okay, you can see the download is almost finished. Now it will start installing the Visual Basic IDE. So we'll just go ahead and let that run. And uh, I'm going to pause here and come back once it's finished with that. That's finished. You should see a window like this. Now just go ahead and click exit. And now if we wait for this. Come down here to your start menu. I know you can't see it. But uh, You can open up Visual Basic 2010 Express, and mine says this product is licensed. Yours will not say that if you just if you're just installing this for the first time. Um, what you'll need to do is you'll need to go up to Help and Register Product. Now this is a free process. Um, you just give them your email and like your name and what you're interested in developing, and then they'll give you just a free license key, and you can use that to register your product. So uh, thanks for watching, and don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe.